summer day across west central Ohio. As we check out those temperatures, they are warming up into the 70s now, 74 degrees here in town. We have 73 in Bell Fountain. Temperatures a little warmer as you head to the south and west, 76 degrees already for Dayton and Cincinnati, 74 degrees right now at the state capitol in Columbus. Across the area, we see 76 Paulding, 74 for Salina and Wapakoneta right now, and 70 degrees the temperature for Finley. Skies continue to clear out. Again, those slightly cooler temperatures that you noticed around Finley because they have had more clouds this morning. We've had a little bit of light rain and sprinkle activity moving through there as well. And as you can see, that's pretty well faded away now and giving way to a mainly clear sky. So for the remainder of the day, we're going to forecast lots of sunshine. So a sunny and warmer afternoon on the way for us. If we look off to the west, there is some rain falling over parts of Missouri, the Show Me State. We've got some showers. Those are down into Arkansas as well. This weak system is going to push its way a little bit further east into Illinois and possibly even into Indiana by tomorrow. But as of now, still not expected to bring any rain for us. So the way continues as far as rain chances. We notice again the rain west of us, the rain east of us, but right in between. We're just sandwiched here with a dry weather in the middle through the weekend. And even it looks like now even into Monday. But then finally, as we go deeper into next week, that may begin to change. And you can see we could use some rain out there. These are the rainfall departures for each month so far this year. And you notice from April all the way to now, each month has come in drier than normal, so it has been a dry growing season for us. And as we look at our forecast, as far as any rain, again, as I mentioned, dry weather expected to continue through the rest of the week. We'll have plenty of sunshine as we go throughout this afternoon. We take this forward into tomorrow. We see that system that we were showing you over parts of Missouri. It does bring some rain as close as, say, Indianapolis tomorrow. But you notice here we're still dry, just perhaps a few more clouds from that system. But the rain continues to sit west of us, and it looks like that system's going to pretty well fade and hit uh, areas across Lake Michigan by Thursday night and Friday and not really make its way here as that system to the east will just kind of block that system from pushing our way. So our, the result will be a continued dry forecast for us from now through the upcoming weekend. So our high today expected to reach 80 degrees. It's been a while since we've been in the 80s. We've had a pretty cool stretch of weather lately, but now we're getting back to a little bit of summer-like conditions as we do run out the last few days of summer on the calendar. Overnight tonight, our low will be 57. We'll have partly cloudy skies. Light winds out of the southeast around 5 miles per hour. Right now, we're not expecting any fog issues for tomorrow morning, so it should be a nice quiet start tomorrow. And then as we go throughout your Thursday, we'll see a few more clouds by the afternoon, but we'll call it partly cloudy. A warm day with a high of 82. Southeast winds 5 to 10 miles per hour, but the humidity levels will stay low. So overall, it's still going to be relatively pleasant outside. As we move forward into your 7-day forecast, if you're making plans for the weekend, the weather still looks very nice for us. We'll see temperatures actually begin to fall off just slightly for the weekend. Temperatures by Saturday back in the upper 70s and 77 degrees for us on Sunday. And then next week, we will try to bring in a bit of a change in the weather pattern. So that change will be some more cloud cover starting on Monday. But we also note temperatures dropping back more typical levels in the lower 70s. And we'll keep our fingers crossed. There is at least a slight chance for some rain to move in once we get into Tuesday and Wednesday.